Today I'm going to tell you the story of David and Goliath from the Bible. Long ago, a tribe, a tribe of people called Israelites, lived and worked in the beautiful land of Canaan. Boys like David, Jesse's son, tended their family's flocks of sheep. One day, Jesse called his family together. My sons. We only want to live in peace and serve the Lord, but the Philistines have attacked our soldiers, Eliab, Abinadab, and Shama. You must join our warriors and King Saul before enemies overtake our land. Father, let me go too. David, you're still a boy. I need you here to feed our sheep. But Father, David, you have much to learn before you can become a soldier. As Jesse's sons walked over the, to the battlefield, they could hear rumors about the Philistines. Shalom, friends. Take some of this fruit to feed our hungry soldiers. Thank you, good friends. Like you, our husbands have gone to fight for King Saul. Many men have returned quick, crippled, and beaten. The Philistine giant Goliath is too strong. No one can resist him. They have a giant, but we must fight or become slaves. Go, and God be with you. As Jesse's sons neared the battlefield, they could hear shouting from the Philistine camp. I am Goliath of Gap, tall as a tree, with arms as strong as iron bats. Ha 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 ha. What we heard is true. Goliath is a giant. Come out and fight, cowards! I need a slave to carry my shield. Ha! <laughs> but as Jesse's sons arrived before King Saul, they heard soldier report. King Saul, we have no champion. Every minute the Philistine giant calls. Why don't you send someone to fight me? There is no one strong enough to fight Goliath. My men become more and more fearful. Good King Saul, we have come to serve you. You are brave men, but I risk my worries against a giant and in heavy armor. It weighs a spear that lies over fifteen pounds. No man can stand against Goliath and the Philistines. Meanwhile, at home, David learned to use a slingshot to protect the sheep from wild beasts. A lion! I have to save my sheep. Oh, little one, you're safe. Don't be afraid. When a bear attacked, David destroyed it too. David became strong and brave. One day, Jesse called for David. Take these five loads of bread to your brothers, and take these ten cheeses to the captain of their army. I will, father. See how your brothers are, and bring me news of the battle. Early next morning, David got up and left the sheep with the keeper. He walked until he neared the battlefield. I hear drums. I must be close to the soldiers' camp. The warriors are are lined up, ready for battle. David hurried to find his brothers. Brothers, what's happening? David, watch out! Goliath is coming. Look at the strength and size of him. <laughs> Choose a man to fight me. If he kills me, the Philistines will be your servants. But if I kill him, then you will be our slaves. <laughs> He is too big. Run, I say. Why does everyone run away? Men who kills Goliath will be in great riches by King Saul, but none is brave enough. Why did you come, David? Are the sheep alone in the wilderness? You just came to watch the battle and ask questions. Eliab, someone must face this giant. I am willing to fight him. You're talking like a foolish child. But when King Saul heard about David, he called the boy to his throne. Let my warriors have spoken of your bravery. My king, I will fight the Philistines. But David, this 
Giant has been a warrior for years. You are still a child, but God will protect me. Once, when I kept my father's sheep, there came a lion and also a bear. They took lambs from my flock. I stripped the lion and took the lamb from its mouth. When the bear rose up against me, I killed him. The Lord delivered me from the paw of the lion and the bear. He will deliver me from Goliath of Gap. Go, and the Lord be with you. Take my, take my armor, my sword, and my helmet to protect you. I can't go on the battle wearing these. I will wear the armor of the Lord. David carefully chose five smooth stones and put them in his shepherd's bag. Then he took a swing and called, "Goliath, I challenge you to battle." You, <laughs> you are only a boy. <laughs> uh, am I a dog that you Israelites? Me, you can beat me with a stick. You fight with sword, spear, and shield. I fight in the name of the Lord. God will deliver you into my hand this day. Oh ah! Uh. has killed Goliath with nothing but the sling and the stone. Most important, my king, is my mighty belief in God, who never fails us. And so God chose the hand of a shepherd boy to kill Goliath and bring peace to their land. The...